wait for that. Yeah, I can wait for that. Sorry about that, guys, when I was moving. So this is, uh, I'm sorry, guys, I hit the thing. Um, we're back. This is part two from the bad accident that took place here in the Interstate 5 off the 223 um, off um, like Old River, guys. Um, that's one of the black tags right there at that vehicle, guys. And we got another one. Yes, fog was a factor, guys. So he said nine feet. Um, you cannot see in front of you, guys. So remember, these vehicles over here, guys. I want to go over here, guys. So apparently this vehicle is right here that you see guys. We're good from the from the front from the front vehicle guys to the second vehicle, the third vehicle, the fourth vehicle, the fifth vehicle. <sighs> this car must have been falling, this truck. Didn't realize these vehicles right here, one, two, three, four, were at a standstill in the fog, guys. Very dangerous. So they were at a standstill. So a truck came in doing probably 55 the regular speed limit to hit this van, to hit that diesel truck, to get into the uh, uh, Toyota Tacoma, and to hit the back of that other pickup, guys. Dangerous. Fog's a factor, guys. You gotta slow down. Especially if that visible, you can't see in front of you. Oh man, pull over to the side. Um, I don't know what the rules is, but this truck was at a standstill, guys. I don't know the law on that. So I guess they slow down and stop because they couldn't see no more in this fog. So I don't know. I don't know. You pull over to the side or you stay on the road. I don't know guys. This is this is the worst accident I've been to um, In a long time guys This is the worstest So you pull over with your hazards on. Um, apparently, um, yeah, I don't know why he was on the road at a standstill. Uh, you know, that's something that the CHP has to investigate. This is 
terrible, guys. No, the one that passed away is right there in that van. He was smashed. Um, you can see the, the yellow um, blanket over him. And the other one's over on the other side. In a vehicle that had rolled over. to the other part now we're going back up guys if you guys missed it uh, we're going back up now so that's where it first started and this is So this truck right here, guys. Remember, one vehicle went off. I don't know which vehicle went off over on to the dirt, guys. Um, I believe it was one of these trucks right here. Uh, so this truck. Morning, guys. Yeah, that's the rollover right there, guys. That is the rollover. Uh, apparently, that's the other um, fatalities that on that vehicle right there, guys, that you see be behind there. Um, you know, you know, fog's um, a big factor here in Bakersfield, California. Um, it's really dense. Um, like he said, he could not see. So apparently, he was at a standstill. At a standstill, guys. Look at that, guys. Ripped that whole tire out, guys. So he dug into the dirt, guys. So this is going to be a while, guys, and a cleanup. RD on the scene. Yeah. What, which, what, what vehicle are you yeah, were in? I'm in that one. Did you go off? No. No, I wonder when it, somebody went off from over there, went off and came I back. Know, I, on, I, see, I seen the marks see tracks. On yeah. The I'm trying to figure, yeah, I'm trying to figure out what vehicle that was. You must have took off then. Or if it was maybe, that truck. Because this truck was back there. There, back there? But I pulled him out. Um, he was high centered. I pulled him out. You pulled him out? And then right after we left, that's when that red car, that mm -hmm. sideways and all that. Yeah, happened, it happened over there. Right, they slowed right down. Behind, right after I pulled him. So the guy was telling me you guys, the, the first vehicle was in a standstill. I, I have no idea. So I was talking to the guy, the flatbed that hit it. Yeah. Uh, he showed me the dash cam footage. Um, that car was stopped dead on the freeway. Yeah, he's dead on the freeway. And that's they, what he was saying. Everybody ran into it. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Why would he do that for? I guess he couldn't see. Well, you're supposed to pull over to the side of them, right? Yeah, yeah. And then, like, when I showed up, like... What truck is this? 
Um, and who are you? Oh, uh, with media. RD on the scene. Huh? RD on the scene. Okay. Where's your vehicle at? Way over there. Okay. Uh, give me a statement of whether my sergeant is uh, back that way. Okay. Thank you. This is crazy, guys. So he was saying that. They watch da uh, the dash cam, guys. Um, a dash cam that that first vehicle was at a standstill, guys. At a standstill. <clears throat> so we do have corners here, guys. Uh, and the examiner to do the first one, guys. So we don't know that Toyota Tacoma was in the middle uh, at a standstill too, guys. When he had to stop because the diesel truck stopped, he couldn't see anymore. Like you know, when like he said, you know, you're not supposed to stop on the freeway, and you're not. So they looked at one of the truck's dash cam. Apparently he was at a standstill. Um, he pulled, he stopped because he couldn't see no more. Seems like multiple vehicles went off to the side because I could see another track. Two, one, two, three. Two, about two, or, two or three vehicles went off the cliff, off the um, this little bridge right here, guys. Um, you can see this one coming up right here, and you got the other one. So multiple cars went over to avoid the accident. Don't know if there were regular vehicles or trucks. Like he said, he, he pulled one out with his truck. So here's another truck he's gonna get try to get pulled out because he's stuck in the dirt. Um, that's propane right there. Good morning. Here's another vehicle. Yes, there was two people. Uh, deceased on scene two black tags um, You could go to part one um, And you can see part one uh, There was two different um, and di two different cars and this is one of the trucks right here guys uh. That was ripped in pieces Morning, guys. Huh? This one right here, guys, <sighs> carrying potatoes. <sighs> Look at this. Up and close, guys.
no, Diane, when I gotta go, I'll go buy my potatoes. It is so, so scary to get in an accident, guys. And this thing is smoking right here. I hope it doesn't catch on fire. Um, this thing is smoking. Not much. Don't know if you guys can see the smoke. Well, it's going to keep me from the cold air. That, yeah, that caused, yeah, McLean's got the freezer in there. What car you guys were in? Oh, straight ahead? Thank God you guys are all right, man. Yeah, man, this is a bad one. Yeah. Bad one, guys. <laughs> yes, two fatalities. Which, which station is, or which um, I'm, I'm RD on the scene for Bakersfield, RD? a live streamer. Oh, okay. Yeah. No, on Instagram or? Um, no, Facebook, YouTube, okay. and Twitch. What is it called? Uh, RD okay. on the scene. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. So apparently, guys, uh, oh, man, this is man, this is terrible, dude. So this way, we're gonna keep going, guys. We're gonna go back up. Uh, we do have a whole bunch of kids over here on this side. I'm going to try not to put them on. So this is the other pile up right here, guys. Um, this is the other pile up. Look at that one. Man. And it keeps going, guys. So we are going to give an update now, real quick, guys. Uh, look like this truck right here went through, guys, and left. the biggest one I've ever been to guys um, we haven't had a pile up here in Bakersfield in a long time guys and I think believe Car Carlos covered that one guys huge one I think it was like 50 vehicles 58 vehicles I believe I don't know if Carlos is on here or not uh. has anybody seen Carlos guys Yeah, this is the first for me, guys. Um, it's a bad one, guys. We've got two, uh, two uh, fatalities, uh, two separate vehicles. One rollover, one was um, crushed.
You're not watching the live, bro? Oh, man, I'm on a bad accident. When's the last last uh, pile up on the freeway? I was, yeah, that was a long time ago, huh? No, we're on the Interstate 5. Yeah, on the 58, remember that one? That was like 48 to 50 cars. Yeah, this is about the same. This is almost like the 25 to 30 vehicles. Yes. Oh, it was foggy. Uh, the, the, uh, the truck was at a standstill on the freeway, and it just triggered. Uh, it's piled up. Yeah, two fatalities. Uh, right off the 223. Okay, then. Bye. So that that CHP guys um, is going down there, going down there with another yellow sheet. I don't know what's going on with that. Yeah, guys, once again, guys, uh, we're on Interstate 5 off the 223, uh, right next to Old River Road. Um, apparently, uh, this is a bad accident, up to 25 to 30 vehicles, guys. We have two fatals on two separate vehicles. Uh, one was a rollover. Um, the other one was um, pretty much uh, crushed between two diesels. Yeah, or it might be because he's on the way down there right now. Maybe they, you know, really were looking inside of one of the vehicles. We don't know. But he's on the way down there with another yellow sheet. So who knows? But, you know, keep these families in prayers. Or uh, We don't know if they're from Bakersfield or they're traveling. They're from another um, city. But keep the families in prayers, guys. Um, Right now, I am waiting up for an update, guys, from the CHP. Said so he will take about at least um, five to ten minutes, guys. I don't know if you guys want to hang around, but apparently uh, they are going to do a um, um, a update on this. Oh, he was putting it away in his vehicle, guys. So that's a good thing. Woo, man. Yeah, he was putting that thing away. <coughs> yeah, I just got off the phone with Carlos. It was like 48, 50 vehicles on the uh, on the 58 freeway, guys. Right now, we're just waiting, guys. Um, if you guys are going southbound, guys, please try to go around. <coughs> if you guys are watching, because you're at a, uh, at a at a standstill, this this freeway ain't gonna move, guys. And if you guys can see way down there also, guys, <clears throat> um, there was mo more, another uh, transaction down there. It took place down there too, guys. So way down there, guys. Way down there. Uh, there's multiple uh, car uh, car accidents, guys. We'll go down that way in a minute. But I want to see if we can get a statement uh, from uh, the first responders or maybe CHP. This morning we had a 35 car pileup, 17 uh, vehicles, and 18 big rigs, and 
and uh, we had a, two black tags and nine green tags, which is uh, you know, two deceased and nine transported minor injuries. And what did you guys do on the scene here? So we got on scene first, fired it, and we did a triage of the whole uh, incident. And we basically just went up and down the scene, which was strewn out over about a half mile, and triaged the patient, patients based on um, how critically injured they were. And then uh, Paul's ambulance, CHP came in, and we just triaged mostly. 35 vehicles, can you kind of give us a sense of how chaotic that must have been? Yeah, it was pretty chaotic when I first pulled up on scene. It was uh, compressed natural gas uh, saddle tanks on the side of some of the big rigs that were ruptured. So a lot of the bystanders that weren't injured were uh, trying to help people and they were in a plume of natural gas. So we had to deal with that first to get everybody evacuated from that area and get them upwind. Okay. Um... Where do we stand now? Right now, um, CHP is waiting for their med team to come do an uh, investigation on the scene. Uh, fire is almost complete. We're going to have to do a few extrications. And uh, we're just waiting, making sure there's no more patients on scene at this time. Extrications, is that for the black tags? Yes, we still have one patient that's unfortunately still trapped in their vehicle. Uh, but the investigation has to occur before we can do it. Okay, how bad was the fog when you guys arrived? It was probably 10 feet visibility. <laughs> okay, anything else? Uh, no, I just want to say uh, great job by everybody and all agencies that arrived on scene. Everybody worked well together and we accomplished our mission. You guys did a great job. Thank you. <clears throat> So there it is right there, guys. 35 vehicles. Um, one still pinned into the vehicle. That way, it's a black tag. Um, apparently, um, uh, uh, there's there's f four, four actually, um, four guys. Uh, transactions. Uh, I mean, like people piled up on four different locations. Um, this is the third one right here, guys. This is the third one. Um, I really haven't walked down there yet, guys. But the fourth transaction um, is down here, guys. It's way down there. <clears throat> good morning. Hey, good morning, sir. Good morning. Oh, let me catch you. Yo, you're good, man. Man. I'm telling you, man, I haven't seen one of these in years, man. Uh, the last one uh, was in 80-something uh, over on the 58. Man. And that was like 40 to 50 vehicles. <sighs> All because of a little bit of... The fog. The fog got yeah. everybody. Well, the, the first vehicle was at a standstill. What? On the freeway. Oh, Yeah, man. they looked at the dash cam that uh, he couldn't see, so he stopped on the freeway. He stopped? He man. stopped. That was the wrong thing to do. He could at least... Yeah. Right. Should have pulled over to the side, but he was in a diesel. You see how this is right yeah. here? He probably would have rolled over or something. So he stayed on the freeway. But he stopped. He stopped. That was the worst thing to do. Yep. This took place about 7.30 in the morning, guys. Yeah, 7.30, guys. You guys are okay? Yeah, we're good. Man, this is crazy. No, I'm okay, I'm right here. I'm just, I'm just waiting, man. Yeah, it was nine nine feet to ten feet visible. Uh, visible, um, you really can't see, guys. Uh, apparently, that vehicle did stop, guys. 
Uh, we're going down more, guys. This is where the the, the last one's at, guys. <clears throat> the last one. No, the, this um, lucky this thing right here, guys. It would have been all bad. I smell gas. I smell propane. You know, we still have ambulance on site in case anybody decides they need medical attention. No, only two fatalities. Two. So this is the uh, the fourth one, guys. So this is the fourth one guys uh, like I said multiple vehicles on this one right here too guys oh, no. don't know if I'm still on or not guys I think my phone died Am I still live, guys? Am I still live? I can't see. Uh, hopefully that I am. Um, I want to show you. Uh, my phone is dying. It sells at 14%. But I cannot see the screen, guys. Okay, guys. We're still live. I want to show you the last part before my phone really dies. So we got this truck involved right here, guys. I can't see the screen. Uh, please bear with me. I can't see none in the comments. And this is the last part right here, guys. I'm using my other phone, my personal phone, to look at the comments. Okay. 
So this truck right here, guys, was carrying multiple multiple vehicles uh, uh, on a flatbed, slammed into this truck right here, guys, that you see. Okay, guys. So this is the last last piece of uh, of the four transaction that took place here on Interstate Five, guys. Um, it goes all the way down, multiple cars. 35 vehicles took place here guys uh two two fatals two black tags one still pending in the vehicle um that will um come out and try to remove him uh unfortunately they're waiting for somebody to come out the corners here uh examiners here uh trying to do the first uh first person in the uh, rollover vehicle then they'll switch to the other vehicle uh trying to uh, remove that person out of that vehicle so this took place on the Interstate 5 by the 223 uh, freeway, guys. Um, multiple, multiple vehicles, guys. I believe they said uh, eight to nine people were transported to the hospital. They say one is probably still in critical. Uh, we'll find out later on. Um, we'll find out later on more details on that, guys. So please, guys, um, forgive me. My phone's about to shut off. I am using my other phone to see the comments. Uh, Carlos, you said I'm still live. Thank you, Carlos. Yeah, 35 vehicles pile up on four different locations on this freeway, guys. And this is the last one right here that you guys seen right here, guys. This is the last part. So keep all families in prayers, guys. Uh, keep all families in prayers, guys, uh, in this in this. Uh, terrible terrible times due to the fog guys fogs was a factor um there was a person said on the dash cam that the first truck was at a standstill because he could not see guys um don't know what's going to happen on that but we'll, we'll we'll find out through the chp when they do their investigation uh when that pops up guys i will next time i go live um i will will share that information with you so thank you guys for joining rd on the scene um if this is your first time here guys please share share follow and share guys um if you're over on the youtube side hit that that bell guys um i am going to shut down guys i can't even see how, how i'm going to shut down because i can't even see the string so i'm going to climb down this hill um, i hope i don't fall uh, I'm gonna charge my phone up guys Yeah, I do have one Stephanie. It's in the vehicle. My vehicles far far away So I love you guys. Thank you for tuning in